Most people who are looking for a wife always make this sentence. Men, they always make this sentence like, I want a woman who will respect me. I'm looking for a woman who respects me so much. That's the kind of woman I would like to marry. You no know, we men, we love women who respect us. We can marry any who is not respecting us. Truth. It's truth. You are right. If I'm a man, and I want to look for a woman to marry. I'm going to look for a woman who honors me. A woman who doesn't use me and play. Who values me. That cares so much. That treats me well. But we forget one thing. One of the things that will make this woman give you all these things I've mentioned. Is because you are supplying equivalent of this thing if not more what she's giving you from when you people started or between she starts seeing that you're applying these things i'm telling you the value the respect you're putting her up as someone who is very special that thing what you supply is what she's giving you in return you can't see a woman, you treat her anyhow. You expect her to respect you, worship you, honor you. It's you who is making your wife respect you. I'm Choma. And I want to talk to you about how respect has destroyed many marriages. Because either the woman or the man misunderstood what respect is all about and put this in his mind set and is destroying everything about his or her relationship simply because that's in what he or she has in their mind is making them not to see the right thing because mindset is there to direct one on what to understand and immediately this mindset is negative there's nothing you do right that somebody can see right the person will keep saying it wrong thank you for watching my video and please thank you for subscribing my channel for those of you who have subscribed and if you have not subscribed my channel please kindly subscribe to my channel and let's go back to the video please in relationship before you get married the relationship has not even started until you get married then she'll show you her true colors then you see the main thing you bought and know if what you ordered was what you got because people are full of pretense because they see you as good they want to harvest you and make you believe in them trust them and bring them in let them come in and they begin to grow root and balance then you will see if that thing what you saw outside what you people were doing outside if it's still the same thing you people are doing here if it's still the same person so you need a woman who will value you who will honor you a woman who respects herself and respects her dignity because if she has this class in respecting herself, she respects herself so much that you're going to gain your respect in treating her right, in respecting her, in seeing her as someone who is worth being your wife. How would you treat yourself? How do you want your wife to treat you? If you can do that by treating the person the same way, the same quality, you want your wife to see you as that you're so special. You're, oh God, I don't know how I'm going to describe it. You're that special person. I want her to treat you like every time dusting you, making sure nothing happens to you. Treat this woman like this and see wonders. That is the key to respect. The key to honor. What will make you come home and say, yes, thank God I made the right choice. 
is how you treat this woman not only in your trust some people refuse to marry one old woman who is older than them because the woman will not respect them i'm just trying to give you an instance and some refuse to marry some prostitutes or girls who are wild who have seen it all have it all because they will not respect them they will overshadow them and open their eyes they don't tear eye and you won't marry them or the second hand women the women who have married before single ladies call them whatever you may because they won't respect you forgetting that this one knows this one knows the good the bad the ugly she knows in supporting you in being there for you in bringing her cash she knows she knows what to do she has had story she has seen to a novice who doesn't know among these two people you know the one who has made so much mistake is the one who has seen it all and had it all she has made many mistakes and she wants to correct among these two people who is going to respect you more respect is it going to bring food to the table you get respect and you don't have food in your tummy after you earn all your respect the woman cannot assist you and make you become someone in future that woman cannot bring you raise you and make you worth something among your friends what we respect do for you i know you need respect i'm not saying that taking respect away from me i'm not saying she should not respect i'm saying what is important to you is it the respect or someone who will be with you and honor you and then respect you because of how you are treating her because this is the truth no matter how hard it sounds i know you don't like it but it's the truth i said i will tell you the truth this is the truth most things that's making women lose some respect they have for men is how the men are treating them you can't have money the woman wants to buy something and every time you keep saying you don't have but she knows you have how can you get respect so in it all is for you to find a woman who understands it doesn't matter how old how she has lived her life before she met you because all that is in the past all matters now is someone who can join whatever she has with you there's no amount of money a woman has that makes her disrespect you there's no fame a woman has that wants to make her disrespect her husband she knows your fears she knows that sometimes you feel inferior or you're going to feel inferior because the money because of the german pass the american green card whatever she knows and she doesn't want you to crop it on her face to remind her oh she's because she has this she has this that's why she's talking to you like that and does not mean that whenever she challenges you means because she's better she's higher than you that's why she's challenging you if you can change this mindset because even the person who cannot buy herself a bottle of drink will still challenge you when you do what is wrong a woman is not someone who sit down and just take it take it take it take it at a time she won't take it again and she will have the right she will remember that this thing is not good and she will challenge you that has nothing to do with whatever she's providing now you are the one bringing money now you are insulting me now you are challenging you are talking to me like this it has nothing to do with it if you can have a mindset that sees things clearly that tells you the truth will be free you will be happy
because even a small child, I don't know if you have a child before, you do the child what is not good, the child will tell you, it's not comfortable for me, I don't like it like this, you will see. So challenge is in everything, it's everywhere. It has nothing to do with who is providing, who has upper hand, who is the breadwinner of the family. And you start drinking, start disturbing yourself, telling the story of my wife does not respect me at all. When you call your wife in front of someone, something happens. You challenge her, you talk to her anyhow in front of people. What do you think will happen? You just insulted and brought her down in front of people. She gets angry and reacts. Oh, my wife has no respect. Look at her. She's talking to me in public. But you started. You couldn't wait to get home. Even if you want to show your anger, then show your anger and say, this is like this. This is how it happened. This is how I feel. You just insulted me. Say it there. Because the moment you start washing your dirty clothes outside by talking to the woman anyhow, challenging her anyhow, putting your words without thinking who it will hurt, you will get exactly that back. Because you're trying to protect your respect. And she's losing it because they're sorting her. The two of you turn to people who are rubbing their dirty clothes aside. So, it's good for us to make sure we have food on our table. Grab every blessings that come our way and forget about respect. Because this respect, some of us do not know what it is. I have a shop. Because of how some men come to me every time and tell me about this respect, how their wife is not respecting them, and when they tell me the case, I don't see anything that has to do with respect inside it. Some people cannot really tell them what this respect is all about. What it means for a woman to respect the husband. Some people have taken this respect as when you want me to do something that pleases you. This thing you want me to do, or you think, oh, you marry one pretty woman and you are not okay. Seeing the woman wear dress and going outside, she might cheat on you. You're living with this insecurity or she might cheat on you. Other men might entice her with that money you're not giving her. Those things you can't supply her. She might see it outside. So you want to cage her. And when she say, no, I don't want to be caged, it becomes that the woman is not respecting you. Example and other things you know. So check if the fact that you're having problem with your woman, is she not respecting you? Or is that you're trying to play a fast one on her? Find out what respect is and try to live a happier life, a relaxed life. Stop looking for some excuses to make someone uncomfortable or some reasons why you will not be happy yourself as a human being. A man can assist his wife washing plates, cleaning in everything. It's your wife. The older she gets, the harder she looks. The worst for you is you will go outside and start seeing other people and bring diseases at home. Or she starts seeing your cheating on her. They have less respect. It can also happen that you no longer find her attractive because you have started cheating. Let it not be that the problem that is going to happen in this family or the one that is happening is from you because you're calling what is not respect, respect. Respect is something like your woman wants to spend a huge sum of money. Like a woman wants to go and buy land and she didn't tell you. And you are the kind of man that when she tells you this thing, you're going to handle it in a way. Even when you don't want her to do this thing, you can talk to her very calmly, like trying to convince her, make her see reasons why you don't want it to happen. Why it's not good if you people do this. If she didn't say yes and go behind you and buy this land, this might be disrespect. 
but if this land is going to help you people in future is going to help you people survive if there is any way this land is going to make you people achieve greater things in future might not be disrespect because anyone outside who sees it as disrespect is not living with you the person does not know the kind of man you are that woman she knows you some people because of some inferiority complex do not want their wife don't do this don't do this and all of you are there suffering but the woman think this thing might help us and she's trying to make you see reasons she's telling you she's saying let's do this i'm seeing something here you say no so sometimes it's good to play fool to become a fool and sin even if it's, if it's mistake you allow her make the mistake next time you will use this mistake to tell her about the other one does not also mean that tomorrow she might not see something good to tell you let's do this outside let's do this other business so the more we give each other chance the more we give our wives chance to breathe to live to exploit in some things they should have freedom for the more respect we get but when you see the person suppress the person sees the person you see a lot of challenges a lot of challenges you're going to see a lot of it because you're trying to squeeze this person make the person so uncomfortable to make sure that the person is really suffering because some of us think wife is something like a prisoner that if we are not saying no 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 to everything the woman wants she's not a wife and she must agree to it but this wife no matter how you cage her she will go out she will hear stories she will watch films she will, there's no way you can deny her even she knows what is right or wrong without her being associating with anybody so we should be careful and don't let our life be miserable or remember simply because we are afraid of going to one person who is rich she will do this you are her husband she will worship you she will adore you are her husband because when she spoil her own she loses she will have no shelter to guide her you will not be that man you used to be you can't protect her again so everyone loves to respect their husband loves to accord their husband that respect let us join hands and make this life easier for us and make everybody comfortable so that this marriage and relationship can be very easy for us so that the poor we know that they can marry the rich the rich we know that it's no problem marrying the poor life will be easier for us this is the only problem we have among ourselves we're feeling too much superior too much inferior is destroying our life it's making us not uncomfortable we'll be seeing food that would have been on the table we will somehow give reasons why we will deny the food and we keep suffering one day one common malaria will just take us out of this world or one common sickness would have cured assuming we are with somebody who is doing well thank you so much for watching so far I hope you enjoyed this video and you understand what I'm trying to say. Because sometimes we might be making this video and someone has something the person is not really understanding. Um, and now I was able to somehow explain this in a little bit. We are all learning. All of us, we are all learning. Thank you for being here.